good morning people um, in this video I will further show you how to add even TV shows and I will continue what I left out with in the previous video on how to add movies for the year 2014 so if you go back to the previous video you will see on the left hand column where I show you how to customize your content and remember again people you can get your own content but I cannot tell you where to get it from however if you do your research you will find out how to get your content that's all I want to say about that and what I'm also going to say is Netflix is not on the same level as Plex because Plex is very very customizable for free for more free so let's start with this this is what I want to continue to show you what I've done so I left out dragging my 2014 1080 movies to this drive from my F drive in order to start a new column so I'm gonna add it remember I went to the movies and then to be under it's gonna be 1080p 1080p is the resolution of the movies people 1080p stands for the high definition resolution so it'll be movies 1080p year I'm on year 2014 Remember, I have over 2,000 plus content, movies, TV shows, etc. Okay, so this is what we're going to name it. I'm going to click next. All right, so we're going to click browse folder. But before I click on browse folder, I'm going to show you something right now. This is the folder that I created to make my movies. This is it. You see this here? Right here. That's the folder. Movies 1080p 2014. That's what I added. I added the movies to this folder from the other hard drive. Okay, so with that being said, let's go. So we're going to browse. I know where it's at now. It's right on my C drive. It's on my desktop. this goes to work watch it go to work people you see there it is it's creating the metadata look at that thumbnails trailers the information of the actors actresses that's in the movies it's creating all of that just like Netflix does it gives you a more information on the actor and let you know what more movies they're related to or what more movies they play what other movies they play it in same thing here but it's doing all the work for you look at this i'm gonna pause this and be right back with you at the same time of the video now i'm just gonna let you see it i'm just gonna let you see it go to work and what i'm gonna do too i'm gonna add a bonus i'm gonna start uh a TV show. I'm gonna get another TV show. This, this TV show is called Boomerang. It's a new TV show that started this year on BT. So I'm gonna name that. I'm gonna let you watch me name that too. I'm gonna pause this just to make this video short. I think I will pause it. All right, it is finished. So let's see. One on one. Let's check on the and see if it works. Of course it will. And this is 300 rounds of an empire. Pause that. Let's skip it. I can't play it fully because copyright strikes. So let's forward to it. Give me one example of when that has ever profited a nation. Okay, that works. Let's try one more. Let's go to. Uh, 
neighbor, neighbors. Let's click on neighbors. Okay. Pause that. Neighbors working. Oh, uh, like her mom, I bet. Mm. All right. So you see, that's a good one. So now what I'm going to show you next is how to add, how I go about adding my TV shows. So I'm going to show you how I do this live. All right, here we go. So, all right. So this is what I'm going to do. To do. I'm going to name this. This show is called Omar. So now I'm going to do TV shows. So I do TV shows. Boomerang. do HD for this one, high definition, brain HD, all right, and then I click the next, now I'm going to show you, I've already, I'm going to create the photo right in front of your face, I'm going to go to my on my screen up here, I right click, click on do, folder and name it, boomerang, the boomerang, Shows boomerang right there. You see that? Click on that and add library. Look up here, TV shows boomerang, and that's it. It's populating, creating the metadata, thumbnails, thumb art, subtitles, etc. Guys, this is for free and it's complete. So let's see what it play. Okay. So, Damn, baby. So that's episode one. Let's forward it. I'm sorry. I, I was just. All right, there it is. So I hope you are getting a better understanding of how you can make Plex your own. Um. So all you have to do is rewind back to this video and watch and go to my previous videos. I will continue to show you tutorials on how to keep making this your own so with that being said please comment hit the like button and definitely subscribe for more content until next time